Hi, kindergartners. Happy Space Week. Your job for writing this week is that you are going to be looking at different places around the world from this website called Google Earth. Google Earth is this really cool website where you can type in an address or a place and it's going to show you from outer space zooming way into Earth from a bird's eye view. It's going to show you that place. So it's kind of like you're traveling around the world from the comfort of your own home. It's pretty neat. So this is the website right here when you type in Google Earth. We're going to click this button, Launch Earth. And it's going to show you this is the Earth here. There's some stars. Remember, stars are different suns in far, far away galaxies. All right, so here we are. Here's Google Earth. You can actually take your mouse or your finger if you're using a tablet, and you can actually click and drag the Earth around. You're going to notice that the Earth is a 3D shape. It is a sphere. It's kind of like a ball. It's the biggest sphere that I know of and can touch. When you touch the earth, you're touching the largest sphere ever. All right. So what you're going to be doing is you're going to be searching different places. And there's a list of different places on this page where you've watched the video. You're going to be searching different places that you would like to go visit. So the first place that I'm going to go visit is actually Everson Elementary. I've already typed it in once before, so I'm going to just click on it. And you're going to watch how we zoom in from outer space all the way into our school. So cool. And this is called a bird's eye view. So this is a bird's eye view of our school. What that means is that if a bird were flying over our school or over our neighborhood, this is exactly what they would see. So that's called a bird's eye view. Now, in part of your writing, your job is to draw a picture of your house or of the places that you visit. We want you to draw this. We want you to draw this bird's eye view of what the place that you visited. Then some other things that you can do. Let me move my talking head. There are some buttons over here. If you click this little man right here, it's going to highlight some places blue. That means you can click on this area. So I'm going to click right here. And it's going to zoom you down onto the street level where you can see our school. And again, you can drag it around to see. I'm sorry, my dog is going a little crazy in the background, but you're going to have to ignore him. Uh, you can see there's Mrs. Adkins' classroom, there's Mrs. Ramirez, and on the other side of the school, if we could see it, would be Mrs. Kleist's classroom. So here's our school. Some things you can do is you can press the buttons to go forwards. You can click and drag to look around. You can go backwards. All of these things are things you can do. And if you want to go back up into space, you just click the little man again, and he takes you right back up. Now... Some other things you're going to do is each week or each day, we want you to go to a different place. And so you'll search those places. You get to choose which place. I might go to the pyramids. That's one of your options. Go to the pyramids. It's going to zoom you way out. And it's going to go all the way over to Africa in Egypt where the pyramids are. And you can see the pyramids here. You'll draw a picture of what you see in a bird's eye view. And some things that we want to know is we want to know where you went. So you're going to write, I went to the pyramids. You're going to tell me what you see. So I can see a pyramid. I can see bricks. If you go down to the street level here, go down here. Write about what you can see. Oh, wow. Look at that big pyramid. So right about what you can see, I can see rocks and brick. I can see dirt. I can see a dog. And then you're also going to write about what you think people do here. Well, I think that people might climb here. I think that people might take pictures here. I think people might dig here. So that's your assignment for this week. I hope you have a great time. Oh, look, there's camels. Sorry, I got distracted. So. Your job is to do this this week. I hope you have a really good time exploring the world and writing about it.